Hi, I'm Roy. Welcome to the next video for 3ds Map for new users. We will be continuing doing the textures for the ladders. Now we're gonna paint this texture. We're gonna paint it red. Let's work with the blending mode right here. Let's have another adjustment layer here. Brightness and contrast. That's good. So let's save this one. Diffuse. Okay. Then let's change this. Let's have this in here. And let's change this here. Let me change this one. So you hit, you select the, the material where it says diffuse, hit the M right here. Then go to bitmap and just change it. And that's it. Now we have a red. So what we can do now to get this to a better state is to damage this ladder because it looks brand new, right? What you can do is to select Let me hide this and hide these two. Let me select all these, right? Let me open the UV editor. And what I can do is to export this tools, render UV template 1024, render, then save it, JPEG, right? And then let's have this as ladder beams or beans. I don't know, just save it like that. Oh, oh uh, UVs. Here we go. And hit OK. We have that safe, we can close this. And then we can go to the internet and write out here decals. Take the S away. And we have a bunch of decals here. You see, mira, mira este que lindo. Y también tenemos un montón más por ahí. Un montón más, mira todos los que hay. Esto le da un montón de realismo a las cosas. Sí. 
so what I will do is that I will write down scratch scratch let me see what happened here we go so I will select I think that I will go for this one. Uh, what it was, what it was, what it was. Uh, right here, number three. This one right here. We download this one. And download this one too. Okay. So let me have those downloaded downloaded uh, textures. We have one here and the other one here. I have it here in the resources folder. And then let's uh, overlay these ladder steps here. No, not not the other one. This one, right there. Here we go. So now. What we can do is pretty simple stuff. We, if we want, we just can drag and drop this here, put it a little bit smaller, rotate it with Control T. You hit Control, Control T, and then Shift, and you can rotate it 90 degrees. And then you can just put it smaller again. Put it around here and you can you see how you can see scratches now? Just working with the blending modes. So now I will have this here and you see what happened there? You can control T and then invert vertical and you're good to go, you see? Too easy, huh? So let's end this video. Let's continue on the next video. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned. See you on the next video.